guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video um i've been just over here relaxing with jc jc i don't know what's been happening you guys There's, there has to be something going around and i've also heard that something is going around jc was initially sick about two weeks ago for coming home from school and literally the entire house got sick jc Yan was crazy sick and then she got over it i'm still literally getting over it like coughing and um sneezing stuffy nose just the whole nine yards and it's been like that ever since she brought it like two weeks ago my entire household still to this day we're all like in and out of it and there's all there's been someone at least sick every single day since jc however got a little bit better and then got sick again um she's, um between yesterday and today she's been just sleeping and laying down feeling horrible she's been crying huh it wasn't my fault. It was Jalen and Daddy's fault. It was? At first, Daddy made me go to school, right? And then people made me sick. And then I had a fever, and I got a fever again. Really? But this is a really good fever. Yeah, it's a really big fever. I breathe hard, and the stuffy nose and my eyes burns, and yeah. I, my whole entire body is hot. Yeah, we gave her some Tylenol, and every time we give her medicine, she kind of, like, comes, like, she becomes a little bit okay, but and then after, she she's right back. Um, but, like, her voice is kind of, like, shaky and trembly. Her legs are, she says she feels like her legs are trembling when she walks, so she really is, I don't know what's up, y'all, so we're going to see. I really think you love going to the hospital. Why would I like going to the hospital? I don't what type know. of thing is that to say? I just think you like going to the hospital. Do you think I like it when my kids feel like this? Oh, Jesus Christ. Do you think I like that my kids feel like this? No. Hey, why his stuff is black? Like, hey, Bucky! Oh, look, Baba is but, sick too. His nose keep running. Yeah. My poor baby. I like his nose when he was in the crib. Poor baby's not feeling good. Okay. You okay? Huh? Come on, let's get up so we can go, baby. I love you. Too. You guys, so my wife likes to go to the hospital. You guys, tell them. Uh, go ahead and tell them the truth. You like to go to the hospital. Be quiet before so you know the how this internet goes. They're gonna be like they're gonna you're gonna make people think I'm like that lady that like Gypsy mom. I'm not Gypsy's mom. Don't like, play with me. Like that one of them people that left a comment on my page saying I made you made me take the kids out of school. Like y'all not about to, you're not about to make it seem like I'm making my baby sick. I'm I'm gonna make sure oh, my baby's no, okay. No, not that, bro. That's what it sound like. No, That's what it sound like to me. Guys, so JC Yan, I'm also is sick. You guys, we're gonna um bring him as well because literally just noticed that his fever is coming. He was only coughing and sneezing and his nose was running. Um. With his stuffed nose, but his fever is coming now, just like Jaycee's. His fever now is what, um, 100.1? 100.2. Um, 100.2. I definitely know that something is because my entire family is sick. That includes my sister and her kids. So we'll figure this out, you guys. We are on our way to the ER. Ah! <laughs> Then why you want him to try it? Because it's poisonous. Because I've been hearing that, yeah. Yeah, flu's gone crazy. Mm -hmm. um, 
and there's every kit that comes in here with fever and with death flu mm -hmm. um and rsv in the little guys sometimes but he's not presenting to you much rsv ish looking to me mm -hmm. usually rsv the kids are really really snotty mm -hmm. um he doesn't look like that but the flu um and strep too but their throats aren't hurting them oh wow holy cow <laughs> dang gone <laughs> that's a lot <laughs> Might as well cancel school altogether at that point. Uh, oh, yeah, that's toilet in the mall. Jane and Jack. Yeah. Okay. Jane and Jack. Okay. Yeah, that's cute. It's almost like I need to put some stuff out there for Christmas. You can hop down, darling. <laughs> you missed your jacket. You missed your jacket. Hi. <laughs> you got that. One. All right. You guys ready to head to the back? Yes, All right. Follow me. I should have checked into the hospital the way I'm coughing. You okay, my baby? Boo boo. Do you want to go lay in your bed? You don't want to go lay in your bed? Why? Why, little girl? They took a temperature to go? What was it? <laughs> you told him she took Tylenol? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Should we put him on the bed? Or? Oh, I think, I think right here is fine. You said you're going to spot for COVID, RSV, and flu? And flu, yeah. So what I'll have you do, Mom, is maybe just hold hands and entertain, and I'll swap them. I try to do the COVID and flu together so that... <laughs> too much, huh? It's not a good tickle, huh? Oh, my baby. This is oh, mommy, tickle, right? baby. You okay? You okay? Hey, baby. Hey, mama. Oh, my baby. You're my baby. I love you. It's okay. Did he? I should have checked myself in here. My, I'm literally my throat is starting to hurt now.
Taste. Tilt your head back. Tilt your head back. Oh, look at that. That's the good stuff. Here, Tilt. Tilt your head. Oh. Sian is my fave cuddle buddy. He's so smoothy. So lovable. My baby. My baby. My baby. My baby. Mama's baby boy. I love you. You ready, Daisy? I'm for your fave song. Mom. The mom. I am the mom. You are the kid. The baby, baby boo. The baby, baby boo. I am the mom. Oh, baby. <laughs> We're seeing tons of it. If y'all are having symptoms, it's probably the same thing. Mm hmm. But uh, essentially the fever wasn't too bad. Um, I think we gave some medication to help the fever calm down. Mm -hmm. And uh, when the fever's down, they sleep better, they eat better, drink more, and heal faster. That's what happened with her last night. What's happening with her is I'm giving her medicine mm -hmm. and then she like, in an hour or two, she's calmed down and she'll talk and something and then it comes back up again after the medicine wears off. Mm -hmm. And then she's back like very weak. And Right, so I think what we need to do is, is um, th that's normal. Yeah. What we need to do, I think, is uh, and when you're in the throes of influenza, uh, what we need to do is to just alternate Tylenol and, and, and Motrin just every three hours. Okay. So it never is getting too high again and has all that time to come back down. Okay. Um, I'm going to have them give you a sheet so you know exactly how many milligrams to give for their weight. Because kids, they grow so fast that they need a lot more medication. So we're underdosing them. Yeah. So then they don't, it doesn't get as low and it comes back faster. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna have to give you a sheet for that. Okay. Uh, I wrote prescriptions for Tamiflu for both. Tamiflu is an antiviral drug for flu that may help decrease the symptoms and how long they last. Mm -hmm. um, sometimes they're not great, I mean, or sometimes it doesn't really work that much. The data is kind of iffy, but we still give it to you know to everyone. Um, okay. Some people like it. Um, <laughs> oh, I, got, I have, I have uh, four more kids at home. I would say if any of them are having are not having symptoms. You know, you may want to go give them a flu shot, you know, at, uh, at any CVS or any, you know, uh, Rite Aid or something like that. Um, but, you know, it's still important to remember that flu is still just a virus yeah. that we do get over. You know, if we can treat the same. Yeah, I thought it stopped after COVID. You know, I didn't see it after COVID. It well, COVID. it slowed down because everybody was at home. Yeah. So because everybody was quarantining, then it didn't spread. Yeah, yeah. And so now, since everybody was inside all around the world at the same time, and now is back out, typically it would move around the world, you know, and have flu season on one side, yeah. when everyone's inside for cold weather, and then comes back around like this. But now everything is just out and about with the world. That yeah. makes a lot of sense. Yeah, well, that's exactly what we're seeing. So we're seeing a lot of RSV. We got tested for RSV and COVID too, also for them, because we're seeing a lot of that both, and those are negative. Okay. okay. Um, just the COVID, just the flu was positive. Those are the only viruses that we. Or testing, but I knew one of them would be positive because so many kids are in here. Yeah, I heard that. Uh, yeah, it's tons. Yeah. But overall, it should be just fine. You know, they're healthy. You know, we just, mm -hmm. I guess, it alternate the Italian on the Okay, thank okay. you. My pleasure. I'm going to have them bring that sheet in.
and then those prescriptions. And uh, yeah, if y'all need to know or anything, just tell the nurse. Thank, thank you right. so much. All right, thank y'all. Have a nice Bye. evening. Oh, babies. It's mommy's poor babies, you guys. So thank God that um, RSV and COVID came back negative. I mean, I guess we're just gonna have to try to break this flu. I'm gonna have to do what I've been doing. Y'all, JC, I've already been coughing. My kids got me sick, so it doesn't really matter that I'm holding them because he's the one who got him and JC is the one who got their mommy sick. We're gonna just wait for um so the papers to come in. Jay-Z had sweating so badly okay, and then so that didn't try it. Paperwork for everybody. Um prescriptions for Tamiflu are on top, and then here is a dosing chart for Tylenol and Motrin. And I went ahead and wrote both of their weights. Okay. Okay. Um I put kilos and pounds because I think on the bottle it, it gives you both R's, here's and pounds. So okay. um Go by poundage because we weight based there, so I'm okay. Okay. All right, so for JC on, he's 17 pounds. So at 18 pounds, he can go up to 3.75 of the ibuprofen. And then the, how old is he? Um, one, 12 months. Okay, yeah. And and it's the same as for the Tylenol, 3.75. Okay. So, and then for her, who is 38 pounds, she can have 7.5 mLs. Okay. okay. So, complete weight based because that that gives us the best results. Thank you so You're very much. Very welcome. You have a nice evening. Absolutely, y'all can expect to probably get it as well. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm. You're there. You're there. there. You're there. <laughs> so it'll go through everybody. Just let me wash this. Um, we have six kids at home, so oh, good luck to us. Thanks. Thank you. See you later. Thanks for watching. Oh, sorry, guys. Excuse how I look, but I just wanted to update you guys. Uh, it's 2 o'clock p.m. here where I am. And yeah, I feel horrible. Like, I have the chills, and then I'm cold. My temperature came up to 101.5, so it's not as bad as JC Plus, because JC was 104. And I got this bad taste in my mouth. What does it taste like? It doesn't taste like poisonous. I don't know what it like, tastes like. Because nothing tastes like this. That's in my mouth. Oh. Do you have a taste in your mouth? And yeah, so... I guess it's Jordan's been walking around with a tissue stuck up his nose. Jeremy's fine. I think did Jeremy get sick? I don't think. I think Jeremy was the and Jay Lynn was the only one who didn't like terribly get sick because Jaylen, like Jaylen, she told me that she lost her voice a little. Bit. Oh yeah, yeah, you guys. I'm literally unable to get out of the bed. I'm very weak. It's two o'clock. I've been in the bed all day, and I'll probably be in the bed for the rest of the day. Like Daddy's in there cooking. I don't even know what the kid's doing. JC's been laying in the bed with me the whole time. So, JC on is with his dad in his playpen, I think. So, yeah, you guys, we're going to be home recovering. Feel my forehead. Is it hot? It's kind of hot. I love you. Do you feel better? Mm-mm. Mm -mm. My teeth right here, it hurts. Do you have an appetite? What's an appetite? Like, do you feel like you want to eat food, or are you able to eat food? You can. You get hungry? Juliana laughs when I do this. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, yeah, Juliana's <laughs> sick too, huh, Jace Jace? Juliana started feeling bad, like, uh, again last night. Coffee. We've been sick twice in the past two weeks. Coffee. It's coming and going. I don't know. It's obviously, something is going around. You guys be careful out there. Costume. Be careful. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna be a police. Oh, 
But I got a three too, cause that's my shot. Who are you gonna arrest? I'm gonna arrest you. Me? Yeah. Why would you arrest me? Cause I'm sick. You? You st remember you stole that money from me? Oh, I stole money from you. I put the money in my drawer for a reason. Oh. The number? How much was it? That ten thousand dollars you stole out of my stash? Why would you take ten thousand dollars out of my money? JC really did that, y'all. I was counting my money one day. I don't have it in my possession anymore because it's like, you know, but I saved money in cash before and I'm just counting it in one day. She just like, I was like, wait, I'm missing some money. Like, you know, I didn't know exactly how much, but I knew that I was missing a bit. This girl had $10,000 in her drawer. She then just grabbed a snack, a stack and walked out. Why you did that? You a menace to society. What did I you think you was going to do with the I'm money? I'm going to erase you for a reason. What you thought you was going to do with that money? Spend it. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to be a police <coughs> when I'm going to I'm going to continue on relaxing. And yeah, hopefully I'll heal in one day. Because I cannot be like this for too long. I have six kids. I have a family. <laughs> I got things to do. I got obligations, Lord. What do I do, God? What do I do? Ah! I am. Uh, uh.